Hey guys, how's it going? Just want to take you through some of the really nice guitar parts through uh, for Hillsong's uh, song Oceans. Really beautiful song, um, and it has really sweet guitar parts in it. So um, let's uh, get right into it. Let me take you through them. It's in the key of D. The main chords are D. There's a G, A, B minor, and there's also an E minor. well. So in the key of D. Um, effects wise it's kind of simple. Dotted eighth. Um, that bouncing kind of delay and I put a little bit of reverb so you can hear that as well. And just a little bit of kind of transparent drive um, that I have as well for that kind of shimmery sound. So um, the first, the intro is just keyboard and vocals, and then the guitar comes in with this really nice part. Okay, that part, um, really beautiful on the guitar. Now, what they're doing there is kind, it's kind of a little bit like triads. Um, they're starting on the uh, G, the chords are G, D, and A. Um, but instead of playing them in the normal positions, you can actually play a G here in the D shape, and then go up the octave to the D, and then slide down to the A here. another way you can play those chords but instead of playing the whole chord like that uh, they just play the root which is G here on the fifth fret um, fourth string the third there on the uh, third string seventh fret and the top one on your E string seventh fret there so if you can see that and you mute the second string in the middle there Okay, so index finger, fifth fret, um, third, third string, seventh fret, first string, seventh fret, okay? Slide that whole shape up to index finger, twelfth fret, fourteen, fourteen. And slide the whole thing down to index finger, seventh fret, and nine, nine. Okay, so all right, and then they just pick it like twice each time. Okay, so and then the last time he just puts his pinky up one like that. that part and then in the verses they're kind of playing a similar thing except down lower in the lower register um, and that was it Again, instead of playing the uh, normal chords like uh, B minor and up to the D up here on the bar chord there and down to the A bar chord and then down to the G bar chord instead of playing those four chords it's just playing the first and the third of each chord so, so B minor bar chord 
and you play the root and the third note here, I use these fingers. And then up here, this is actually a D, a high D bar chord. So just play the root note and the third where your middle finger would normally be. And then down to the A, A bar chord is normally here, play the root and the third where your middle finger would normally be. And then down to the G bar chord, root and third. Okay, so that's all they're doing there. And then in the middle, they're letting this open uh, D string ring out. So you don't play a bar chord, you let it ring out like, like this. Okay, so starting up here on your B note, 7th uh, 7th fret, 6th um, string, middle finger, and then I put my ring finger here on the 7th fret, 3rd string, mute the top two, you don't want to play them, but let, and mute the A string, but let the D string here ring out, so like this, 1, 2, 3. Okay, so let me do that again. 7th fret, slide the whole thing up 2 frets, okay, and then here, so you've just got your um, index finger here and I use my ring finger here, alright, on the 11th fret, and then he just does this little thing with his pinky, and then slide down. Fifth thread here, ring finger here. Again, this little thing with the pinky, like a suspended kind of thing. And then down to the third fret, and right here. So the whole thing goes like this. A little bit fast, uh, you got to get used to. Okay, so hopefully you got that. And then the other part is this part, which is really nice. B minor here, or the top part of a B minor is right there, and then the D you can actually play up here like that, um, and then an A like this, and then he slides up to an E minor, but without the root note like that, um, and all the time he leaves this top E string open, so. This is the B minor, instead of playing that B minor, leave the top E string open, and like this. Okay, I use my pinky, if you can reach it like that, that's fine. Pinky on the 9th fret, and 7-7, seven, seven, uh, 3rd string, 2nd string, 7-7, seven, seven, open E string. Okay. And he kind of picks around something like that. This is probably not exactly precise, but it's something like that. Okay, so the root. And then drop your pinky off to the open D string and keep these two on. And then 
to the A, this is the top part of an A chord, but keep the E string open and play. Okay, one more time. You can see that. One, two, three, open. And then slide it up to the E minor shape up here on the seventh fret, but you don't need to bar that. Just use one, two, three, these three fingers here, okay, and open E string. Something like that. Okay, so B minor like this from the start again. Pinky off, D, open D string. A, up to the E minor shape without the root. Okay, so let me play that a little bit faster. So there it is. Oceans, beautiful song. Hope that helps. Uh, go and have some fun with that. See you next time.